This is Crypto Kernels. I am your host, Asa Kane. In this episode, we're going to be taking a look at the number two ranked cryptocurrency in the world, and that is Ethereum. Now, before we do so, if you haven't already, make sure that you click the like button, which is the thumbs up icon that you see right there directly below the video. What this does is it helps to share our video with other people like yourself who are new to crypto and want to learn as much as they can now. Now, also, if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button, which is our logo that you see in the lower right hand corner of your screen. What this does is it ensures that you don't miss out on any episodes of Crypto Kernels. Now, what is Ethereum? Ethereum is a decentralized open source blockchain system that features its own cryptocurrency, Ether. Ether works as a platform for numerous other cryptocurrencies, as well as for the execution of decentralized smart contracts. Ethereum was first described in a 2013 white paper by Vitalik Bertelin. Bertelin, along with other co-founders, secured funding for the project and an online public crowd sale in the summer of 2014. The project team managed to raise 18.3 million in Bitcoin and Ethereum's price in the initial coin offering was 31 cents with over 60 million Ether sold. Taking Ethereum's price now, this puts the return on investment at an annualized rate of over 270% essentially almost quadrupling your investment every year since the summer of 2014. The Ethereum Foundation officially launched the blockchain on July the 13th of 2015. Since then, there have been several network updates. The most recent was on August the 20, oh, I'm sorry, August the 5th of this year. It is named the London Hard Fork. What makes Ethereum unique? Ethereum has pioneered the concept of a blockchain smart contract platform. Smart contracts are computer programs that automatically execute the actions necessary to fulfill an agreement between several parties on the Internet. They were designed to reduce the need for trusted intermediates between contractors, thus reducing transaction costs, while also increasing transaction reliability. Ethereum's principal innovation was designing a platform that allowed it to execute smart contracts using the blockchain, which further reinforces the already existing benefits of smart contract technology. Ethereum's blockchain was designed, according to co-founder Gavin Wood, as a sort of one computer for the entire planet, theoretically able to make any program more robust, censorship resistant, and less prone to fraud by running it on a globally distributed network of public nodes. Now, in addition to smart contracts, Ethereum's blockchain is able to host other cryptocurrencies called tokens through the use of its ERC-20 compatibility standard. In fact, this has been the most common use for the Ethereum platform so far. To date, more than 300,000 ERC-20 compliant tokens have been launched. Over 40 of these make up the top 100 cryptocurrencies by market capitalization. For example, USDT, LINK, and BNB. Now, who are the founders of Ethereum? Ethereum has a total of eight co-founders, an unusually large number for a crypto project. They first met on June 7th of 2014 in Switzerland. Russian-Canadian Vitalik Berlin is best known out of the group. He authored the original white paper that first described Ethereum in 2013 and still works on improving the platform to this day. Prior to Ethereum, Butterlin co-founded and wrote for the Bitcoin Magazine news website. Now, if we look here, we can see that as of today, December the 16th, 2021, the price per Ethereum token is 4013 <coughs> Now, if we look down here, we can see that the current market cap is $476 billion. And 
and if we move over here, we can see that the current circulating supply of Ethereum tokens is 118 million. And the total supply as well. Now, if we scroll down, and I want to look at the last year because over the last year, I've not only seen Ethereum's growth, but I've also experienced it for myself personally. Now, if we look here, we can see that 1217 of last year, the price of Ethereum, which was a little over $600, its current all time high, which was reached just a few weeks ago, a little over a month ago, was $4,800. And it has since settled currently at just over $4,000. Now, if you want to get any Ethereum, you can do so in several places. Number one, you can get it on Binance directly. As you guys know, Binance is the largest crypto exchange in the world. You can also get it on Coinbase as well as Crypto.com. And if you don't have accounts set up with either, we've included links for both in this video as well as on our About page, which you can see here. And by signing up using our links below, you'll earn over $60 in free crypto today. And also, in addition to your crypto, the most important thing is to protect what you have already. The only way you can do so is to have a cold storage wallet. Now, Ledger is one of the leading worldwide manufacturers of crypto cold storage wallets. They are based in Paris, France. What you do is you move your crypto off it, whatever exchange you have it on, and you move it into your cold storage wallet. You and you are the only one that will have access to it. It's having your own bank, your own personal bank, and it is the only way to own crypto. Studies have shown that less than 20% of crypto owners have cold storage wallets in fact and until that number changes we'll keep talking about it now if you order from ledger especially with it being the holidays it'll take probably three to four weeks to receive your ledger but it's more than worth it another thing i want to stress is always buy from an authorized retailer never from amazon or ebay or any other third party because it's not safe as well. Now, if you've received value from our video and you want to contribute to our channel, you can do so by using our Ethereum link, which is shown in the video, and also our Cash app. And lastly, make sure that you subscribe because we have a lot more coming up over the next several weeks. And if you have any questions, you can leave them at our email, CryptoKernels at gmail.com I answer and read everything but until next time get in there and make it happen